Ladies and gentlemen, it's your boy Sabal and your one-stop shop for K-pop and hip-hop. And today, we are going to be checking out some tracks from probably my favorite vocal group in the game right now. Y'all, hey, I love this group so, so very much. So much so that I went to one of their concerts and I got VIP. It's Black Eyed Pillsung's very own. It's High Up Entertainment's very own. It's the group that y'all know is BAM! Okay, stay C. All right, like I said, I love them so much. I had to go see them in Brooklyn. Hit the bomb by accident. We had to get that VIP. You already know, man. Hey, one of the best concerts I have ever been to, man. Shout out to Stacy. Shout out to the Team Fresh tour. I got the hat, but I'm not gonna wear it for this review because you know it doesn't match the fit. You can't be wearing a, a purple hat with a blue jacket. But anyways, we have some tracks here that we're gonna check out today that I haven't gotten around to listening to because. Listen, I'm very patient when it comes to doing reactions or listening to K-pop, okay? If I haven't watched it or reacted to it on this channel, I have not listened to it, period. We've got three tracks that we're gonna check out today because there's nine tracks I believe that I haven't gone around to yet. Here's a list if you guys uh, are curious about which songs I haven't listened to yet. We're gonna listen to these right here. We're gonna listen to the B-side off of Stacey's debut single, it's So Bad. The B-side from that was titled Like This. We're gonna check that out. And then we're gonna check out two B-sides from Stacey's debut EP, Statum. Those two tracks are titled So What and Love Fool, man. I'm excited to get into it. Swiss, are y'all excited to get into it, man? Let's do it, bro. It's Stacy. It's like this. It's So What. It's Love Fool. It's a ball and it's like comment. Did you know the only 6% of y'all are subscribed to the YouTube channel? Hey, Swiss, before we get into this reaction, before we get into these three songs, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that bell to get notifications whenever I post because it helps the channel grow and gives you the motivation to keep pumping out videos for y'all, man. So without further ado, let's get into the first track. The first track is titled Like This. Let's get right into that right now. Let's go. All right, let's get it. Let's get it. This is the first B-side. This one is titled Like This. This was the B-side off of their single, their debut single, which was So Bad. And I thought So Bad was so, so good. And I'm excited to get into the B-side, man. I have no idea what it sounds like, but I'm expecting it to be some amazing vocals. Some amazing everything from Stacey Girls is going down. You already know. Let's go. Turn this on my headphones, man. All the way. Let me know how y'all feeling at home, man. How y'all feeling? Ah, okay. Black Eyed Pill Song has to bring out the fancy sound effect. So we got it for twice. Now we got it for Stacy Girls. It's going down. Turns out some more. Poppy, poppy. Oh my god, they're trading the bars? Oh my god, Saiyan's voice is just so beautiful. <laughs> oh, yo! Like, what is that? Hold on, hey, stop, stop the stop the track, Isa. Man, Isa, like I, I, I say this, I feel like I say this in every Stacy video. Isa's vocal tone is just so buttery smooth, so beautiful. I could hear, I could hear her talk about the phone book. Read a Dr. Seuss novel. I don't even know. Narrate the news. Uh, whatever you want to do, Isa. You like more the Morgan Freeman of K-pop. Talk. <laughs> oh my God. Like, what is that? Like this. Oh my God. Mm. Who's laughing in my ear? Hey. Mm. Oh my god. Oh. A beat break right there. This pre chorus, the build up to this chorus is so good right here, too. Oh my god, how are they doing being with a B-side as good as this, bruh? This could have been a TT. Oh my. 
like this. actually so gross bro it's actually so gross how good this group is with the vocals with the with the visuals with the dancing with the everything uh, first thing i want to talk about is that oh uh, sound effect man black eyed pill song said hey we use that in, in twice fancy we got to bring that back for stacy girls is going down hey every time i hear that sound effect all i can think of is no matter what i do oh no shout out to nelly man Oh man, this beat is so good. The pre course when you get them snare rolls into and into the drop. That chorus is so good. Suman and Jay trading bars in both ver in both verses, I believe. So dope, man. Okie dokie, poppy poppy. Maybe that's like a precursor to poppy poppy. Maybe that was like the beta test. And that was really good. Saying handling pre quarters duty, she did her damn thing on this man. Shout out to saying my bias for a reason. Isa, bro, like I said, Isa, uh, 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 I, 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 I could never make it sound as good as she does, but oh my god, that part was so fire. CN handling the chorus duty, she did a really good job, and Yoon as well, and Yoon hitting that high note in the bridge in the final chorus. Oh my goodness, you talk that talk, man. They all did the damn thing on this. It's just pop R&B bliss, pop R&B goodness. It was just a dope ass track. It's an instant asset to the playlist. It's a banger. You already know, man. It's Stacy Girls is going down. And when the Stacy Girls, we're always going up, man. What are you talking about? What? So yeah. <laughs> that was a dope ass track, man. We got two more left on this part. The next two tracks were from the debut mini album from Stacy. That that mini album was titled Statum. There were two B-sides on that. It was So What and Love Fool. The the what was the title track for that? Oh, the title track was ASAP. ASAP was the song that got me into Stacy. They're the reason. That song is the entire, the entire reason why I love Stacy so much. And I'm excited to see what those B-sides sound like for us here today. So the first B-side is So What? Let's get into So What right now. Let's go. All right, y'all. This is the first B-side off of Stacy's debut mini album. This one is titled So What? I'm excited to get into it, man. Because, hey, Stacy, nothing but hits, bro. Let's get into it right now. Let's not waste y'all time. A little bit of a... Are those two guitars? Woo! Yeah, What's wrong? Uh. Damn! Ooh. I like that guitar riff right there. Okay. Wake up, wake up, Oh my god, Isa again! Uh. Oh my god, so many bars! Oh, the auto tune! Oh, 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 oh. Stop, 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 stop the track, man! Oh my god! She ain't got bars now. She got flow. She got bars. And she got the auto tune. A la Travis Scott. A la Don Tolliver. What are you talking about? A la Kanye West before he went crazy. What? Oh my goodness. Uh. Uh. Oh, the message. 
계속해 걱정 마 괜찮아 나중에 나중에 고민해도 되잖아 우와 가만히 Just like Sunday morning 날좀 내버려둘래 생각이 너무 많아도 우와 this is so dope Slow. Assuming. Oh, that's saying right there. Oh my God! Did I see it in the back? Oh, Stacey, man. Oh, my God. Uh. Come on, Stacey girls. Stacey girls. Stacey girls. Son. Not only can they give us the bops, not only can they give us the raps, not only can they give us the vocals, they giving us messages in here as well, bruh. Hold on, let me go to, you can sleep late, you can sleep till late. Not, what? hold on, hold on, what was that line, Suman? What was that last part? Not washing isn't too bad. What do you mean, Suman? What you mean by not washing isn't too bad? <laughs> you mean it's okay to not take showers? I don't know about that. I don't know about that one, but I mean, the official lyrics might, this might be a mistranslation. The official lyrics might, or someone else, someone who else who can actually speak Korean might have a, a different idea what the lyrics mean, but I love that, man. You can sleep till late, bro. You don't have to be productive 24 seven, man. You don't have to be, you don't have to be always doing something to feel like you're contributing to society. You can take a break. You can relax. You can, it's okay to rest your mind, your body, your soul, man. Talk that R&R. &R. Even if you gain a bit of weight, don't worry. Weight is just a number. When you step on that scale, that number on that scale doesn't define who you are. Who do? Def what defines who you are? It's what's in here, man. Jay, talk that talk. Talk that self improvement. Talk that body positivity, self love type talk, man. Jay, that's a dope ass message, man. You know what I'm saying? Why you think I'm wearing a jacket inside my own house? I'm just <laughs> but yeah. It, but like I said, the message on here is super, super dope, man. Like the, the beat in here, more pop R&B, greatness, goodness, a little cleaner guitars. I think we had a few guitars on here. Take your time. Don't worry about the future. Worry about right now. Mindfulness. Okay. Live in the moment. Because whatever what happens in the future is going to happen in the future. Just worry about what's happening right now. Too many thoughts make my body heavy. If you get yourself paralyzed by thought, you're never going to be able to do anything, bro. So step out of that. Stop thinking too much. Just go out, live life. Empty it till you're worried if it's too much. You don't. Oh my God! I love the messages on this track. Uh, we're tearing KB, not 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 Korea broadcast station. We're tearing Korean beauty standards down. Don't worry about all that. Just be yourself. And that's what I'm talking about, Stacy. Yeah. This one, I'll give this one an extra point just because of the message is so positive. I love that. And then we got an S-T-A-Y-C. You know, as someone who didn't listen to the B-sides, when I heard S-T-A-Y-C on Bubble, I thought this was like a whole new thing for them without knowing that they did it on a B-side on their debut EP. So that was, I guess that's like a callback to like the good old, the, the, the old days of Stacey. It's crazy to think about. They're coming up on their fourth year as a group and from a small company. That's freaking amazing, man. Oh my gosh, shout out to Stacey. Shout out to High Up Entertainment. Like our pill song, right on them. What are you talking about? Anyways. Sorry, I just love talking about Stacey. I just love, I just love giving groups their flowers when they deserve them. Okay, especially a group like Stacey who are absolutely killing it. They're still on their tour. I think they're in Poland right now. Holy guacamole, man! All right, let's get to the last B side. I've been rambling. Let's get to the last B side that we're gonna check out in this video. It is the B side, the second B side from their debut EP, Stadium. That track is titled "Love Fool." I think there's another "Love Fool." 
Doesn't EXO have a Love Fool on their last album? I think so. But uh, hey, let's get into Love Fool right now. All right, this is the final track we're going to check out on today's little Stacey Catch-Up three-part series that I'm probably going to do. Uh, this one is titled Love Fool. This was the second B-side off of their debut EP titled Statum. Love Fool. Let's get into it right now. Let's go. Don't start off the track with them heavenly vocals. Ooh, doo -doo -doo -doo. I like that. What? Oh my god. Oh, it's so teen fresh right here. You don't get to ask me twice. I'll do it. It is pretty dark in here. Oh. The layering on her vocals. What? This is what this is they to do this track. Say it, it's just killing it. Ooh. So when Sumi gets down low, so good. Same thing with Jay, man. In the back. Oh, this this track is gonna get emo gave me emotional. Hold on a second. Uh, uh. Damn. Jay's vocals are shining on this track. Oh, the late, the doubling, I think, on the vocals right there? What? Talk, you. Talk, see it. Oh yeah, this is a, this is a con this is for the concerts. Give me this chorus, final chorus. Come on, take it there. Oh my God! Together, go high low. Uh. I say assume it. I don't know. Oh my god, another yo, what the what are we There's nothing more to say? Every track is freaking amazing. You know what this track reminds me of? You know what this track is giving me? I feel like this is like the beta test. The oh the the let's try out this style first. The beta test version of of Young Love, which we which was on the obviously the younglove.com EP, kind of like that similar type, uh, like laid back drums. But I think Young, Young Love took it to another level. But on this track, we got like guitars. We had a little um, what was that a tambourine in the bridge? We had snaps, a, a, a guitars. It was just so so freaking nice, man. What? Like there, like Teen Fresh is just the perfect word to encapsulate everything that Stacey does. It's just like young love, young love, like what? That's so perfect. What are you talking about? Talking about what's it like to fall in love when you're when you're a teenager or when you're in your early 20s, you know what I'm saying? You, you get starstruck. 
light up this dark place when you open your eye what it is just it is just awesome man the way the, the way the lyrics are written the way the lyrics are delivered the way the instrumentals co-harmonize with the members vocals oh yeah jay this is jay's track shout out to jay man i feel like in my stacy fandom i haven't given jay her flowers yet but on this track i'm gonna give jay her flowers jay absolutely killed this track man when you combine the deep vocals that jay possesses and has mastered you combine that with the chilled laid back instrumental on this track it just adds it's just so it's it's like it's such a great combination man it's like like spam and rice what are you talking about man and uh i love this track man i love this track just talking about love i guess i can't really do anything about this dream life feeling when you fall in love for the first time it feels it's different you know what i'm saying all my people who haven't fallen in love yet feel bad for you man shout out to y'all shout out to all my people still looking for their first love <laughs> put your hands up if you still <laughs> anyways this track is awesome it's a vibe it's an instant asset of the playlist man I love Stacey for a reason, man, and they prove it on every single track. Shout out to my bias saying. But Isa, she's right up there. She killed it. And they all killed it on this track. Wrapping up on that, let's talk about these three tracks as a whole. But that's just what I think. Let me know what y'all think down in the comments below. Did you love these three tracks? Did you hate them? Why? Shout out to Anthony Fantano. Which of these three tracks was your favorite? I Honestly, I'm kind of torn. I'm kind of torn between So What and Like This. I, if I had to choose, I would probably say Like This. I think I, think I just like pop r&b style of I like this a little bit more but the message in so what is very is top tier so if you're a, if you're a fan of nice messages in your tracks i think so what would take the cake but for me like this is just it's just it's more fun to listen to for me so i'm gonna go with like this uh so what and love fool though are both really great tracks and yeah i'm excited to continue this journey we got about six tracks left i think after this one and after all that, I don't even know what to do. Do I do a tier list? Do I rank all the Stacey tracks? I think, how many do they have? Like 17? Something like that? I'm excited to check the rest of those tracks out, man. Hey, Switz, hope you had a good time watching this video, man. That was Stacey. That was So What? That was Like This? That was Love Fool? That was So Bad? That was Statum? That was Sabalin? That was Like How Many Did You Know? The only 6% of y'all subscribe subscribed to the YouTube channel. Before y'all go and do your own thing, you know what I'm saying? Before you go experience some young love or become a love fool, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that bell so you can get notifications whenever I post because it helps the channel grow and gives you the motivation to keep popping out videos for y'all, man. So, with all that being said, in conclusion, Switz, I will catch y'all in the next Stacey Catch Up video and the rest of y'all mother suckers in the next video. Peace.